all right what is going on youtube welcome back to the channel as you can see it is nighttime. i am in the truck but i know you guys like the flounder gigging so i'm gonna try to keyword try to see if i can get on some gigging today however we are not in the state of louisiana we're actually in mississippi i decided to drive uh about two hours uh going towards biloxi i'm just gonna ride the beach see if we can find these flounders somewhere came here last week did some scouting found a few areas where they might have some fish located but it's very different for me uh because i'm so used to gigging in louisiana it's about one o'clock in the morning the tide is low it's rising perfect all the factors are coming together we're gonna get out the truck we're gonna go to the water and we're gonna walk the beach and we're gonna see if we can get some flounder enough talking let's get in the water let's see if we can get on some fish hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys for watching All right, you guys, um, I really hope you guys can see. This is my first time using my GoPro at night to gig. Well, this version, I had my old GoPro, but this is a GoPro. I didn't really change the settings or nothing, but I hope you guys can see it. This is the light I'm gonna be using. It's one of those little cheap blue lights, but I mean, it might get the job done. Oh, it's, it's actually, it's not as bright as I thought. I don't have high hopes for this light, but we'll see. And as you can see, the gig is right here. As you can see, it is a uh, two prong. I'm gonna see if we can make it work. Don't have any barbs on it. So I'm gonna have to pick up the flounder. That's gonna be a pain in the ass, but we'll make it work. So let's uh let's use this light and let's see if we can get on some fish. Hopefully that water clarity is not that bad. So all right, you guys, you can see what this light is capable of. I can't really tell if the water's bad or not. It's not as bright as I want it to be, but I can go out a good little ways. I can still see the bottom right here. So we're just gonna make it work. We probably can't really go in no deep, deep water, but I wasn't planning on going too far out anyway. I don't know if you guys can see that right there. It's a jellyfish. I don't know what kind that is. I don't think it's a moon jellyfish, but the moon jellyfish you don't have to worry about too much, but them other species of jellyfish, I wouldn't mess with those to be honest with you. So I'm trying to watch out for those as well too. But right here is our first flight. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's a different type of flounder too. Yeah, you guys, this life sucks. <laughs> even when the water is technically kind of clear, you, you only still got like not even three feet visibility, which I mean, I can make do, but it's, it's at the kind of like literally be like right on top of the flounder. All right, you guys probably ain't gonna be able to see it. Where is it? I think it's right here. Uh, it looks like a flounder bed, which is a good sign. I'm hoping I have one. Oh, wait, yep, there's another flounder bed right here. All right, you guys, when we see flounder beds, that's a good sign. I might have one in the air, so now I gotta keep looking. Look, there's another flounder bed right here. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch of them. Now we just need to find one that's actually still sitting in their spot. What was that one right there? first one you guys right here hold on and it's a keeper too finally that's a 12 incher ah, there we go all right i got him you guys here's the hard part right here i'm gonna have to hold it down so i can reach up under and get them all right let's see if we can grab them hey. hold on buddy hold on come on all right you guys we got the stringer through his mouth so i can actually Oh yeah, definitely over 12 inches. I don't know, y'all guys can't see that real well, but now y'all can see him. Definitely over 12 inches, but still not the biggest flounder. Definitely a keeper. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap him around my wrist and we're gonna keep seeing if we can find some more. Why don't you guys, it's been a hot little minute. Probably about 30 minutes or so since I got that other one. There's one right there, a little baby. Probably about uh, maybe five, six inches or so. A small one, I'm gonna let him go. Right there is the, the bank. And he's just sitting right there. So I'm just walking this shoreline as far as I can go. See if I can find some flounder just sticking out. Those sandy, sandy bottoms is really, really where these flounder are going to be hiding at. There's another one right there. All right, you guys. We're coming up on one right now. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that's also a keeper. It's a little bit bigger than the first one I got right now. So we're going to get behind him. He's a good one, too. Ah, here we go. I put so much force into like stabbing them because I just feel like if I <laughs> if I half ass it, they're just gonna get away. All right. Hope you guys can see that. That is a that oh, it's a pretty pretty flounder too. Let me go ahead and tie them up real quick. All right, you guys. We got two. One's a little bigger than the other one. That's definitely a keeper. I know that's a keeper too, but 
two so far. We're gonna see if we can keep going. We're just gonna walk this beach, you guys. I mean, it's right there. I caught him literally right there. We're just gonna walk the beach, see if we can get on some more. All right, you guys, we got one right here. He's literally like, look, there's the bank right there. <gasps> Hold on, hold on. I just scared him. I know you guys saw that. Me over here trying to explain to y'all should have just gigged him. Hold on though. He might not have went that far. He probably just scooted up a little bit. And he got a little, little oh, there he is right there. There he is right there. That might be another one. <sighs> we ain't taking no chances. I ain't about to sit here and hesitate. Oh, that's a good one too. All right, let's put the light over here. Mm. Woo! Yep, that's a good one right there. Hope you guys can see that. Hope you guys can see it. It's not a good flounder that's caught on the string. There we go. Uh, it sucks out, I can't see it, but that's three of them right there. So, you wanna keep rolling. It look like the wind is starting to switch. It's starting to come from the south now. So, try to see if we can hurry up and get before we get uh, too choppy out here. All right, you guys. Y'all might can't see it that well, but there's a flounder. All right, this doggone garbage light. He looks 12 inches. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Ugh. Oh yeah, he's a feisty one. Oh yeah, he's 12. I misjudged him, but he's definitely 12. I can't believe I got this many flounder. I kid you not, after that first spot, I got so discouraged. And I was just like, you know what? Maybe this wasn't a good day. However, you just can't give up. That's four. <laughs> We actually doing pretty good. Want to keep it going, you guys. We still got plenty of bank to to go in. I mean, what that what that big house looking thing, whatever it is, so my truck is. So we walked a good little ways, but this is good results. Really good results. There's a little small one right there. The baby. It's a good sign, though. I mean, they still got flounder along this bank. All right, you guys. I might not be able to see this one that much, but this one right here, he might be on the small side. I'm gonna pass him up, even though. He might be, but this is the thing about seeing Louisiana, this would have been a no-brainer. I would have stabbed his ass, but <sighs> I'm gonna let him slide. The only thing I'm kind of worried about now, you guys, is <laughs> how long. Oh, hold that thought. This is actually a keeper. <sighs> okay, kind of. Okay, all right, all right. Got some fight in this one, all right. It's a battle, you're not gonna win, buddy. It's a battle, you're not gonna win. Hope you guys can see him. He's actually, ooh, I gave him right in the head. Good shot, good shot. All right, we got one, two, three, four, five. Five flounder, that's pretty good, you guys. We're gonna keep it up, only five more to go. I might not get a whole limit, but I'm actually satisfied with what I got. We gonna keep walking. Got a good one right here, you guys. Probably the biggest one of the day. Oh, okay, probably not the biggest, but he's definitely bigger than the past few I just got. That one's definitely over 12. No doubt about that. Oh yeah, you guys, that's starting to look like a stringer right there. Six down, one more to go. All right, you guys, that's definitely 12 inches. I'm gonna go ahead and get this one right here. Boom. <laughs> he ain't know what hit him. This gig hit him, that's for sure. My gig and placement sucks, I ain't gonna lie to you. That one is actually, I almost missed the damn thing. Jesus Christ. I don't know y'all can see the placement of that gig, but I almost missed them. I don't know how the hell I did that. Ooh, that's starting to look good. That's seven, you guys. Eight is the lucky number. I'm almost at my end point, so that might be the last flounder. Who knows? So far, it's been pretty good, though. It's been a very excellent, excellent night.